Hi everyone. My name is Miss Tina and I work at the Palos Heights Public Library and this is my chance to share some of my favorite books with you and tell you a little bit about them. So I have two books here. The first book that I'm going to talk about is The Chicken Squad and it is by Doreen Cronin. So if you like bad guys, this book might just be for you. The Chicken Squad is made up of four fuzzy chicks and each of them has a silly name. So one is named Dirt, another is named Sweetie, and then there's Poppy and Sugar. So at the beginning of the book, there's a dog and his name is J.J. Tolly. And he is a retired search and rescue dog who's in charge of protecting the chicken coop. But he's also very tired and he loves to nap so he is not too great of a protector. The story starts off with a squirrel named Tail running into the chicken coop. Tail is convinced that something is chasing her, but she doesn't know what it is. The chickens are on the case. First, they need Tail to describe what the thing chasing her looks like. The problem is, Tail doesn't know her shapes. And to make matters worse, Tail faints whenever she gets too scared. When she sees the dog, she faints. When the chickens show her a picture of a circle, she faints. Finally, the chickens have figured out what the scary thing in the backyard is. It's a UFO that has come to take away their mom. So, again, if you like mysteries and you like silly chickens, this book is for you. This book also has pictures in it too um, to help you imagine what's going on in the story. So this is a picture of J.J. Tolly, the search and rescue dog who loves naps. As you can see, he's looking pretty tired in the picture. And there's lots of other pictures too. So here you see a picture of the chickens and they're trying to work to solve the case. And it is just a funny book with lots of silly characters and this is tail the squirrel who is looking like she's about to faint so i'm not going to ruin the story for you i'm just going to tell you that you should go ahead and check out this book because it is funny and another funny character that i really like is amelia bedelia and the title of this book is amelia bedelia unleashed so Amelia Bedelia's parents have finally given her permission to get a dog. And she is just on the hunt for the best dog. And uh, Amelia Bedelia always gets into lots of silly trouble and things come up. And she is just, sometimes she gets confused. Um, so a poodle actually helps Amelia Bedelia ride a skateboard. And to help find the perfect dog, she walks 10 dogs at once, and she meets a boy named Charlie. And he has a poodle named Pierre, who taught Amelia how to ride the skateboard. And um, Charlie asks Amelia Bedelia for some help grooming his dog, because his dog is gonna be in one of those fancy dog shows. But the problem is they shave a little bit too much fur off of Charlie's poodle and then he just runs off and runs away um, and in her search to find the perfect dog Amelia Bedelia visits a shelter and she looks in the park she gets advice from a dog walker and she also goes to a dog show but after Pierre escapes will Charlie and Amelia Bedelia be able to find him before the dog show do you think Amelia Bedelia is going to ever find the perfect dog? You should read this book to find out. So again, if you like reading funny books and you like reading about dogs, then this book is for you. Okay, and it is Amelia Bedelia Unleashed, Unleashed and it is by Herman Parrish. So you got two funny books. You got The Chicken Squad by Doreen Cronin and Amelia Bedelia Unleashed. So please come visit me at the library and ask me for one of these two books.
Thank you. Have a good day.